What's up guys, Sonic Dolphin 117 here, back with another part of Tokyo Mirage Sessions Sh Sharp FE. And today we have just finished the prologue of the game and are moving on to Chapter 1. I've positioned myself a little further away from the TV, so I hope everything goes well with the echoing, or at least gets better. Chapter 1, A Star is Born. That's weird. I thought I adjusted the volume right. Okay, a sec. Not 47. Not 43. Not that. Sorry. God damn it, Elgato. Come on. Fuck it. It'll be fine. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> I was messing with there. Well, here we are. It's more like an office than some kind of secret base. Well, yeah, it's an office. Ever heard of Fortuna Entertainment? Oh, I know. That's the production company that Kyria belongs to. There we go, got it. Should have figured you'd know it, Tsubasa. But yeah, this is the Fortuna Entertainment Office. What? Really? Why was I brought to a place like this? Just a regular production company on the surface. But secretly, a team of Mirage specialists and investigators. That's Fortuna Entertainment. Oh, and I haven't told you guys yet, but this is the production company I've been working with. Why didn't you tell us about it? Yeah, you don't have to t worry about telling us where you work. If I knew you were working at the same company as Kyria, I would have asked you to give me an autograph. That's what you're angry about? See, boss, I kept my mouth shut because I knew this is how you'd react. Never mind all that, Toma. So, where's Kyria? Oh, she's not here. Why not? Geez, Tsubasa, chill out. Kyria's pretty busy with work right now. Not only does she have a ton of work, she's got to get ready for that live performance, too. She's got her schedule worked out down to the minute. Even I haven't seen her in a while. Aww. <laughs> Tsubasa? You okay? Yeah. Uh... What are you doing? Right now, I'm breathing air that Kyria was breathing. Oh, I can die happy. Alright, there was someone I wanted you two to meet. Who's that? Eh, yeah, you'll see. They're waiting for you just past that door. I hope the volume's good for you guys. Come on, Tsubasa, back to reality. Wait, I'm not done enjoying the atmosphere yet! I wonder if we are only in control of Itsuki for the entire game. Food and drinks from shops and vending machines will fully restore all HP and EP and cure all status ailments, including unconscious. In addition, when cast members consume a food or drink that they enjoy, it temporarily raises their luck stat. A cast member cannot have multiple luck boosts from food or drink active at the same time. They each cost 160 yen. Which drink should I get? I tr H true O. Strawberry Mochi, Macho Mocha. A versatile libation suitable for quaffing or cooking alike, and quite easy on one's palate. A resounding success. Tuki's party was healed. Well, I just bought one for the sake of. So what's this? A puzzle? Shelves span this wall. It seems like a logical place to display trophies. Play records are logs of the things you've accomplished while playing and awards are given based on completing certain combinations of play records. When you earn an award, its trophy will be added to these shelves. None of these affect the story, they exist merely to track your efforts and look back on fondly as your career blossoms. This is where I put my trophies if I had them. Let me see. Aw, oh, Tiki, no! <laughs> Alright. I wonder if we're about to meet her right now. Cause I don't, again, I don't know all the characters in this game. Yep. Alright, I've seen, I recognize this location from the previews. That I've seen. It really is pretty.
Getting a lot of awakening vibes from the tree. What is this place? How is a building like this in an off- How is a place like this in an office building? Mind blown, right? This place is from Mirage Masters and those with strong performa. Those chosen by fate. This place. There's something about it that feels oddly nostalgic. Yes, for me as well. I wonder why that is. Kaida? Where have you been all this time? Oh, so she calls him Sheet calls her Sheeta. Why is it pronounced Sheeta? Whatever, I'll call her Sheeta. She's been with you since we left the Idolosphere. You just couldn't see her, that's all. As long as they're in the Bloom Palace, though, they can go back to these physical forms. Hey! Tiki! She's suddenly just sitting there. Oh, Big Brother! Big Brother? What does that mean? Huh? Why do I feel as though I've met her before? I can't believe it. I can't believe you're making this little girl call you Big Bro- Wait a minute. I think I've seen her somewhere before. Oh my gosh, it's Tiki, the Udaloid! The virtual singer! A real-life Udaloid? What? <laughs> There's the reaction I was waiting for! And don't accuse me of the creepy stuff. You noticed that first? Look, let me introduce you. The Udaloid you two know is a cover. Tiki's true identity is a mirage. Welcome to the Bloom Palace! I was waiting for you, big brother! Big brother? Wait, me too? If I'm not supposed to call Tuma that, can you be my big brother instead? Aww. Well, uh... I don't mind. <laughs> I don't mind. Yay, thank you! You're just really cheery. You might be overdoing it a little. Oh, thanks for telling me that Tsubasa was in danger back there. I didn't do anything worth thanks. That's all I could really do. I wish I could have gone to help, but all I can do is stay here and pray that everyone comes back safely. What do you mean by that? I'm a little different from the others. I'm bound to this place. Wait, I'm Big Brother. Do Krom and Shida still have their memories? They both said they have no idea why they're here. It sounded like they couldn't remember much. I knew it. Wait a minute. Tiki, are you missing your memories too? Hmm. I don't know why, but all Mirages have lost their memories of the past. That must be scary for you. Yeah. Thanks for worrying about me, big brother, but I'm okay. We found Krom and Shida. And you and Tsubasa seems like nice people, so I'm really happy. Aw, Tiki, you're such a sweet girl. I'll be sure to come visit you every day. Thanks, Tsubasa. Well, I think that just about does it for interactions. Interactions. Introductions. <laughs> Tiki, you want to give them an explanation on Unity? Unity? You mean that game maker? <laughs> that game making engine? <laughs> you know you have Performa, right? Well, Performa is like the power of the human soul to express itself. I kind of want to let them finish their lines, and I kind of don't. We fuse Performa with people and mirages to awaken new power within them. That ritual is called Unity. Awaken new power? Hmm... Well, I guess you could just say it makes you stronger. I can't really fight like the other mirages can, but I can perform Unity rituals for you here. So let's perform Unity right now, okay? How anime is this gonna get? Welcome to the Bloom Palace, the miraculous stage where Performa blossoms. Guess what, big brother? You can perform a new unity. It's called Carnage Unity. Yes, that sounds so sweet coming from a little girl when you use the word carnage. It's a ritual of fusing mirages with Performa obtained from enemies to change them into new carnage. By performing Carnage Unity, more powerful carnage can be acquired and new skills can be learned from them. This is an element that is a must to complete the game, 
so it's best you make good use of it. Don't forget to check out the new Unity you can perform. That's the Unity where Krom and the other's Mirage power increases and they transform into new kinds of weapons. Select the Mirage. Move the cursor onto the carnage you want to learn more about and press Y to see the skills that can be learned from that carnage. Or press X to check the details the performer needed for it. So... So these are the type of enemies that we have to fight in order to get them. So we have Falcon right now. Falcon. We can upgrade this. And then we have one weapon here. But you already have this carnage. So I can give him... Why is Iron Sword better than Falcon? Whatever. Alright, so let's see what the others have. Pegasus Knight. Oh, I can't. I don't have enough for her. What about Kane? Yeah, they did that on purpose. Okay, so let's... Upgrade to the iron. Upgrade to the iron sword. I never thought I'd ever say that. Okay, so iron sword. Is this right? Yes. Okay, let's perform unity. Though I gotta say, the iron sword looks cooler than the falcon in this game. So maybe that's a good thing. What? Is he fighting a mirage, like, to train the weapon? What is he doing? <laughs> a new Carnage Iron Sword has been made. All the skills from, you will gain no new skills from it. If you have a different Carnage whose inheritance has yet to be completed, try using that one instead. Do you want to equip the Iron Sword we just made? Ah, eh, fine, it looks cool. Through the effects of Carnage Unity, the Mirage awakens to a new skill. Krom can now use the special performance, Empty Wave. So yeah, no one else can... ...be a performer that you haven't found yet. Alright, so I just leave? What do you want to do next? Come back when you find more performer. This is all I can really do, but I'm happy as long as I can help you all, even if it's just a little bit. I'm more than grateful for the help, Tiki. Great! I'll make sure to do my best. Goodness. So, Bloom Palace. Is there anything else? So, we talked to her here in order to get Carnage built up. Well, not built up, you know what I mean. So, here's Kane. <laughs> Sir Itsuki, Toma seems pleased indeed at the prospect of fighting as your comrade in arms. I'll be counting on you to help Tuma. He can be a bit senseless at times, but he has a good heart. Sure. By the way, Kino, your memory's gone as well? Yes, I've lost all memories of my time before meeting Toma, and as of now, their return seems unlikely. I see. But I confess, I've gotten quite used to my life alongside Toma and the others. However, that doesn't mean I have lost my desire to find out who I really am. Kane. If you need anything, I'll always be happy to help. Thank you, Sir Itsuki. Oh, Itsuki, hello. Hello, so you can materialize when you're in this room as well, then, huh? Yes, it would seem that way. Itsuki, I would appreciate it if you would look after Tsubasa. Sometimes I believe she can be a bit, you know, oblivious, perhaps. <laughs> well, you're not wrong. And besides, it looked as though Tsubasa trusts you quite a lot. I'm sure she'll need your support. Well, she's been my friend since we were kids. I'll do what I can. <laughs> Thank you. A strange place indeed. If we can manifest here, this sanctuary must function similarly to the Idolosphere. Yeah. Taking form in your world consumes quite a bit of energy. We'll stay here in the meantime, barring emergencies. By the way, Itsuki, you'll be fighting alongside Tuma from now on, right? Yeah, to be honest though, I have almost no idea what I should be doing. In truth, I could say the same. Memories are all still in a haze. I know I'm a mirage, but I can't even say for sure what a mirage is, let alone who I am. 
or what I'm supposed to do now. Krom. Mm. But if I stand by you, something tells me I'll find the answer. So I hope you can put me, put up with me remaining at your side for just a bit longer. Ah. Of course, it's all right. Besides, I wouldn't have a chance against the mirages without you. I can hide the text box. What's the point of this? Here's to a long and prosperous relationship, Krom. Thank you, Itsuki. It'll be a privilege to fight at your side. You can usually find us here when things are quiet, but if you ever need us, we'll appear to help you. <laughs> the Bloom Palace is kind of special, a special kind of place. So in here, the mirages can show their actual form. Surprised? First, the Fortuna office, and now this big open space inside. My heart's pounding from all these surprises. All right, so we're getting out of here now. Hmm. Looks like Miss Maiko's back. She said there's something she wants to talk to us about, so you better head back to the office. You're going already? Sorry, I promise I'll come visit again. Me too. Well, I'll definitely be back soon. Okay, I'll be waiting. Bye bye. God, she has like the reddest cheeks. Like, oh my god. She looks kind of chubby with those cheeks. Okay, so here's my trophies if I had them. And time to get out through this elevator? What is this? Miss Michael wanted to speak with me. I should go to her desk. Her desk? I don't know where that is. Is it here? What is it? Oh, there she is. Hey there. Miss Michael. You're so mean. Why didn't you tell me about the production company before? Oh, relax. I didn't want to overload you guys. Too much information at once can be a bad thing. Anyway, I just booked a lesson for you, Subasa. A lesson? That's right. Dancing and voice training. I decided we're going to debut you as an idol. I think we're going to go with the pure and Im innocent image for you. What? But this is all so sudden. I... Better get used to it, Tsubasa. This is exactly how Miss Maiko likes you to run this place. What about the Mirage attacks? Unfortunately, we have no idea when the next attack might be. So in the meantime, let's start your training. Trust me, you'll make a great idol, Tsubasa. My radar is never wrong about someone's star potential. Uh, you know, if you work as an idol for Fortuna, it'd probably be a lot easier for you to meet with Kiria. Where do I sign? <laughs> That was quick. Sure was. By the way, you'll be going through singing and dancing training too, Itsuki. Huh? Me? Yes, you. Training as a performer will help your abilities as a Mirage Master as well, so it's worth your time. What exactly does that mean? Your power as a Mirage Master is dependent on your abilities as a performer. What do you mean, as a performer? Some of the earliest records of the performing arts come from dance as a part of religious rituals. The idea was to call the power of the gods into the performer, an invocation of spirits, if you like. Call upon the power of spirits, kind of like a Mirage Master's power. There's a dance in no theater called Kamioroshi, where the performer calls upon a god. It's a little like that. Musical ability, acting, artistry. Honing these skills also increases your power of spiritual invocation. Basically, if you're good performers, you'll be strong masters. I'm not running this agency as just an empty front, you know. In any case, I've already booked you two for training. Life is about overcoming challenges, you know. Good luck on your first lesson. Um, Itsuki Tsubasa, it'll be nice knowing you. I'll make sure to say something real nice at your funerals. Huh? What exactly are you talking to us like you're sending us to our deaths? You'll see when you get to the studio in Shibuya tomorrow. I've ordered the full course, so have fun! That'll be all for today. Dismissed. Uh oh. It's your first step in the industry. Lessons are the basis for everything, so pay good attention and learn what you can, okay? Here's. There's Tiki's room. I already forgotten what it looks like. Selecting a location on the Tokyo Access Map will enable you to travel. In addition to pressing A at specific areas on the edge of the field, you can press X to open the Tokyo Access Map as long as you're outdoors in a city. 
So I need to go to Shibuya. Daitama Observatory? Should I go to Daitama? Yeah, what's going on here? Is this the place we started off in, I assume? Because he did say he was in Daitama in the beginning of the game. What's this? While you're in the city you're investigating a dungeon, you may discover characters with a yellow request icon. You can take on requests by speaking with them. You will be rewarded for completing requests from these characters. There are no deadlines for requests, and they can be started at any time, so be sure to accept them when you have time between investigations. It's Kaneya Rabe from school. Oh, it's Suki! What brings you here? You always leave right when school's over. You busy with work? Hey, are you interested in fortune telling? I got something you can help me with, is that alright? See, I'm the president of the fortune telling club, and I want to practice my gift, if you know what I mean. And that's where you can help me out. All you gotta do is let me look into your future, and then re you report back after. Alright then, I'll tell you your fortune, but take a step back. It's dangerous. Mm. Eureka! Approach with modesty and outcomes shall be favorable. Approach with haste and nothing shall go as, as planned. Or I guess if you want the quick fix, as it were, then you should go forth. Onward to Daitama's round elevator. And uh, that's all there is to it, see? Great, I look forward to your full report. Requests that have been accepted and are currently underway will be displayed as green icons. When the conditions of the request have been fulfilled, the icon will turn purple. Speaking to the character in this condition will complete the request. The current state of request can be checked from the map as well. So now we have to... Is this it? The Daitama Elevator? Well, no, because I have to... That's the exit to the world map. That's not the elevator. Oh, there it is. This it? No, that's just a soda machine. Alright, let's check the idolosphere. It's weird. It's just hanging out in the middle of nowhere and no one thinks this is a problem. It's just wide out in the open. So is this where we were? This is where we... Oh, yeah. This is where we were. Alright, let's fight one Mirage and then get out of here. Special performances can now be used. Special performances are skills that use the SP gauge located in the upper right of the screen. Alright, so that blue star thing. Can trigger sessions while ignoring affinities, and many have powerful effects unlike other skills. The SP gauge will fulfill as it will fill as to perform actions or connect sessions. So, this is a special performance. Well, I don't really need to use it, so... Let's just attack them normally. I don't think I need skills. Granted, I might want to heal myself. Alright, these guys are easy, though. Wow, that was... Okay, I didn't care. That was easy as hell. Oh, wow. Uh, okay. Krom got the skill again? Oh, ease it. Skill boost. Oh, so it increases my skill. Is this okay? This is good. Indeed, great. Alright, let's get out of here. I should probably progress with the game. So, it looks like this is the same portal that we went through at the beginning of the game, so... This isn't where the side quest wants me to go? I'm really confused, because he's... She said go in the elevator, but this... These look like elevators, but they're not, like... They just lead to the map, so I wonder what she wants. Oh well. Day of the lesson. Oh my god. I hope this place isn't too big. Goodness, I don't want to have to run around here. <laughs> lesson studio, okay. 
My goodness. Huh? Urgent topic. Alright, I'll read it aloud. Ah! What's wrong? What's wrong? Our first lesson is about to start. I see Subas is nice and nervous. That's Maiko. The studio I'm having you two visit today is called Azume Lesson Studio. It should be right across the street from your train station. It has a really flashy sign. You can't miss it. Looks like we still have some time. Why don't you check out Shibuya while you're looking for the studio? Subasa, this is going to be your first step into the entertainment world. There will be good times and there will be bad times, but just remember, it's all to help you become a star. See ya! Various facilities are located in Shibuya. Numerous items can be purchased at the convenience store Hiho Mart. Accessories that act as armor for Yasuki's allies can be bought at the jewelry Karabia. Other elements can be found here as well, so be sure to completely explore Shibuya. So, let's look for those accessories. Huh? We got a call from Tiki. Hi, did I surprise you? Tuma gave me your contact info. I'll use Topic to help you out in a lot of ways. Good luck, everyone. And then she has a cute little picture of herself that says, You can do it! Aww. <laughs> That's cute. This is to the map screen. Oh, wait. I can't. That's not a map of the city, it's just a map of... Well, it's a map of the city, but it's not a map of my current area. It's to the map. So if I go outside the boundaries, that also lets me leave. I have to freaking press a button to cross a street? What the hell is this? This is a cafe? This is a cafe? Welcome! What should I get? Alright, so this is where you buy food, huh? I'm just gonna leave without saying a thing! <laughs> and Tiki's profile on Topic says, I love to sing! Teach me some new songs you've made! Zura is pissed. All right, where where are we going? What's this place? Oh, what? It's the cafe again. No, I want to leave. <laughs> I'm not interested in what you're selling. <laughs> so okay, so that was just the other door. <laughs> well, what do you can you do? I didn't. Is there a label that tells me where it's going? Wait. Oh, freaking... Michael wants to talk. Itsuki, are you nervous about your first lesson? Remember, experience is the key to success. Good luck. Fight on. With a picture of a bunny and a martini. That's an odd combination. Uh, Alright, so is this... this wait. Various magazines lie on their racks. Alright. This is a hee -haw mart. This is for food. This is across the road. Get out of my way, you colorless people from Ruby. Except they're black and Ruby and not multicolored. Where exactly? All right, so we need to find that accessory shop. That's what I'm looking for. Sorry if I feel like I'm. If it feels like I'm running around all the time this episode. I'm just, huh? Toma, what is it? It's almost time for your first lesson, huh? I've got work, so good luck, I guess. Try not to lay down and cry. It's <laughs> a coffee machine. Oh, here it is. A store that mainly sells silver accessories. Can I not go in? Looks like it's not open yet. Alright, so I can't go in there yet. Well, that sucks. But at least we know where it is. So let's cross the street. Oh, 
And here we are in the dance studio. We'll see whatever cutscene this is, and then we'll cut the part off. Who the hell is this guy? Hmm. Heavy set man. <laughs> um, are you our training instructor? Shut up! I'm not. I'm still doing my signature pose. Signature pose. Here it comes. In a world of terrible singing, only one man can make it sound good again. Barry Goodman has arrived. I'm Subasa Oribe, sir. It'll be a pleasure to work with you. Okay, Subasa, got it. You can call me Barry. Okay, Barry. Wait, Barry Goodman. Someone you know? Maybe. I remember a Barry Goodman was one of the guitarists at Curia's live concert a few years back. Apparently he was a guitarist for a famous American rock band, and his solo albums sold millions. But that Barry Goodman was a lot more athletic looking than him. So it's possibly a different person? Afraid not, Tsubasa. You're looking at him. How much weight exactly did you put on? Tsubasa! Oh, I'm so sorry. Don't worry about it. The little lady's got a point. Barry Goodman's just a merry fat man now. Yeah, that's all in the past now. Alright, kid, you're up next. Name, please. Tsuki Aoi. Pleased to meet you. Michael told me to give lessons to some rookies. And anyone who enters this studio starts out a rookie. I'll try my best. Good answer. I'm pretty in the zone today. Alright, let's train three times faster and tougher than normal. Three times normal? Do we really have to? What, you don't know? Today's the release date for a figure of one of the best anime ever, Dio Witcha Iroha. And they've only got a couple limited editions that come with a special bonus. God, I gotta get there on time. Okay? What, you got something to say? I'm not allowed to be a fanboy, huh? I didn't say anything. If I can't buy the limited edition, my life is over. So I need you guys to cooperate and finish this quick. Uh, if we don't make it out in time, Atsuki, I'll just make sure you get in line with me. I got it. Triple speed's fine by me. Maiko asked me to give you the full boot camp experience. Honestly, though, I'd say triple speed still isn't enough. All right, you better prepare yourselves, rookies. Barry's lesson begins. So she's trying to sing? No! How many times do I gotta tell you? You can't. I can't feel an ounce of your soul in that singing. If you're gonna howl and wail, get in the alley with the dogs. Listen, Tsubase, my training can help your voice. Do you think you're going to move anyone singing like that? No. Because that's what I'm hearing! Keep singing like that and there'll be no point putting you on a stage. You're an entertainer now, Subasa. Professional. People are going to pay big money to see you perform. You need to understand what it means to be a professional. If you can't do that, quick now and get out of showbiz. I can't do that. I need to find my sister. I have to... I don't give a damn about your reasons. All you're doing right now is singing for yourself. I can't feel any message you're trying to put into it. For myself? Then how do I put a message within my song. I can't just give you the answer. You gotta figure that out. You gotta feel it within you. And you, Itsuki, don't just brush this off as Tsubasa's problem. I'm talking to you, too. Y yes sir The freaking phone's going off. Give me a sec. One more try. All right, that should be better. Okay. Do 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 do. Stop! <laughs> How dare you interrupt lost your thoughts? This is a waste of time. I could have been doing something actually productive, like watch an anime. If you want me to teach you anything else, you better go study up on your Dia Witch Aroha. Oh. But I didn't even get to see Itsuki sing. <laughs> Sorry, Itsuki. It's probably my fault that Barry got mad and left. Don't worry about it. I'm sure I made a lot of mistakes, too. You just ended up taking most of his criticism. 
Because it's tough being an idol, huh? All this has got me thinking. About working as an idol? No, I was just remembering my sister. Oh, I thought... I don't know, I thought mentioning her would be insensitive, but okay. It's just hitting me hard, realizing what a tough world my sister was living in. All the training and work as an idol may have been really difficult, but she never even showed a hint of that. She was always so kind whenever she was back home. She was so cool and brilliant whenever she was on TV. I'm probably just not cut out to be an idol like her. <laughs> I think you're pretty entertaining. I'm sure you'll make a great idol. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to take that as a compliment, but thanks for trying to cheer me up. I guess you really never change, huh? I'll give it some more thought on my own. I'll see you later. Oh. Hey. What? Oh, come on! Hello, um... Yes? Well, uh, thank you for rescuing us at Daitama. Don't worry about it. But I just walked past your friend. Is she okay? She looked pretty depressed about something. We just had a lesson with Barry, and we just ended up making him mad. Hmm. Well, getting mad is basically Barry's job. So, you gotta stand there and listen to her sing, right? What'd you think? Eh, why not? I thought she was really good. I don't think she'd really deserve that much criticism. Huh. So I see. Hey. You two really want to be singers. I don't know if I'd go that far myself, but I guess so. Really? A singer has to use their song as their words. Huh? As a singer, she's still a newborn baby. Hasn't learned to use her words, you know? But a baby still has emotions. That's why they cry, right? Still have to express their feelings somehow. I guess so. So she should have sung as though she was crying. Barry would never miss that message. So you're saying I should get Tsubasa to cry before training starts? No. Silently hands you something. Kyria's ticket. Here, take these. What's this? Tickets to my live concert. Concert? Yeah, you should come watch it with her. It's up to her what she takes away from it, but I'm sure that she'll... Hmm? Well, never mind. Yashiro Tsurugi's my, my co-star. He's a top-class artist. I'm sure his performing skills can inspire you to be a better master. Well, I have to get some practice. See ya. New urgent topic. Sorry I left without you today. <laughs> you know, she's got a picture of a little guy crying. It's like the Binding of Isaac picture on Twitch. I was feeling a little down earlier, but I still plan on trying my best. I got a surprise for you. A surprise? I got tickets direct from Curia for your concert. Are you serious? She said, are you serious right now in all caps? Well, that turned around quickly. Super serious. Do you want to go watch it with me? It's this joint concert thing called Civ Live or something. Civ Live? The one at the 106? Yeah, that's the one. Oh my god, I can't believe this. OMG, I can't believe this is what it actually says. And then she has a puppy whacking her tail with little hearts around. Wait, so if I hadn't gone home, I would have been able to get the ticket directly from Kyria herself? Ah, I'm so stupid. I shouldn't have gone home. At least you got to get to go to the concert, right? But I feel like I totally missed out. Angry face. I'm glad you're back to normal. I'll give you your ticket on the day of the concert in front of the lesson studio. Thank you. And then she has the emote of the guy crying with the W. I have to describe this out loud. Because, ugh. Alright. It's always casual clothes have been edited as the costume lesson mode. You can now change your cast member's costumes. The cast member's costume can be changed by going to the wardrobe in the menu. Changing costumes enable you to view your cast members fighting in different outfits. 
and so the day of the concert. So basically I can have Tsuba Tsubasa and Itsuki just fighting in their normal clothes. That'd be kind of fun, but I like their nor I like their uh, Carnage outfits, so. Let's read this last thing from Tuma. Oh, by the way, Itsuki, you see that scroll bar on the top far right of the screen? If you press the very bottom of it, you can just skip ahead to most recent messages. He's talking about the gamepad. Wonders of modern technology, right? Don't skip over any of my messages, though. All right. So we're going to save the game here and cut the part off. I hope you all enjoyed. There was a lot of exposition in this, uh, in this episode or part or whatever you want to call it. Uh, I like saying episode more. I don't know why. But anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed. See you all next time. Hopefully we get some more action. Adios.